Most of the U.S. Olympic athletes are homeward bound now, following a hectic day in the nation's capital yesterday. Last night, celebrities Peter Marshall, Patti LaBelle, Leonard Nimoy, Jamie Farr, and the Lennon sisters lent their talents to a gala celebration at the Kennedy Center. It was the close of a whirlwind day for the team, which was feeded at a White House reception earlier in the afternoon, President and Mrs. Carter hosting. A day which began at the Capitol. The President addressed the team here, but the response was cool. Clearly, the Olympians still harbor bitter feelings where the Olympic boycott is concerned. I was a shoe in to win the gold medal, and uh, as a result of the, the, the hurdle final just two days ago, I would have won the gold medal. The time wasn't that, that fast at all, so I, I just feel very bad that that opportunity, that dream didn't come to reality. Uh, when I started seeing some of the highlights on film, I think it hurt a little bit more, and I know we should have been there. To know that we couldn't go really is disappointing to us, but we're here in support of the 84 Olympics. It was a day to remember for the athletes, but the team is also well aware that the activities were sponsored by the U.S. Olympic Committee and not by the U.S. government.